Welcome YouTube to the grand finale of Ben 10 Ultimate Alien Week as I review the Viewscope Ultimatrix. Um, this is the first Ultimatrix toy released in the market. Um, it's not a deluxe uh, Ultimatrix with a lot of sounds and whatnot. Um, it's more along the lines of that little Viewscope one, but it's kind of done in a different style, which is very cool. I decided to pick it up and bring a review and check it out and whatnot. Um, and I will be picking up the deluxe version when it hits stores. Um, as you, per usual, let's go ahead and get started with the packaging. Um, same style of packaging as all the others, except there's kind of a white outline with some old kind of DNA colors in the back, like the original series. Same standard uh, Ben 10 Ultimate Alien logo with him in the action pose. Um, here we have the uh, Ultimatrix view scope here. Um, shows how it works with these little uh, discs you pop in. Um, then there's a secondary one. And then shows how it works. It says view scope Ultimatrix. And on the back it shows you how to use it in case you're stupid. And then it advertises the uh, Alien Collection, which I've already reviewed. So uh, let's go ahead and get this dude out of the packaging. Okay, now that we have everything out of package, let's go ahead and go over what you get in it and the look of it. Um, it is a lot uh, bulkier than the previous ones due to the fact that the Ultimatrix is done in a more of a gauntlet style. But still very nice. Um, a little bit more of a lighter color than on the show, kind of a bright, obnoxious green. But that's okay. The details are uh, pretty decent. We got the two panelings here, um, all done in a cartoonish green. It still looks uh, okay enough. Got this little black button here for whatever. Uh, I think to take it off. Then we got what this huge knob dial here. Kind of a cool translucent dial here, which almost looks like it's from the movie. Um, and then the strap here, which can fit my wrist. Uh, it's green and small, and it's K. Okay. Um, so and then uh, this pops up here to reveal these. Um, let me turn the light off just so I can show you the stuff. It comes with two little revolving discs with approximately 12 aliens on it. Um, I put the, This is actually the disc that was in it. I put the second disc in it to start because mine actually has a broken peg at the bottom and I didn't want to have to deal with uh, taking it off off camera. So there is an on switch here. Turn it on. There's no noises, just lights. So let's pop it up and it glows green. Cool here. Here's the top green. Uh, shows the aliens. Let's go over. You turn it by turning the top here. So we have NRG, Ultimate Echo Echo, uh, Ultimate Cannon Bolt, Ultimate Armadrillo, or no, Armadrillo Regular, uh, Amphibian, Ultimate Big Chill, and then we go back to the beginning. Uh, let's close it down and turn it off. So to change it out, all you do is take this Omnitrix symbol off the top and then maneuver this out of here. It's very simple if you're not an idiot like me. This might take a second. Let me do it off camera. There we go. Now, just take the other disc here, line it up with the uh, things at the bottom, and it'll just kind of snap right in and ease in. Um, there we go. Now, then just uh, put the Omnitrix back on, line it up uh, with the corresponding whatnots. You'll see where it lines up. Sorry if this takes a second, sorry. Um, let me do it off camera again. Alright, sorry about that. Now, we got it all ready. Let's turn it on. Um, now, open, green, coolness, uh, water hazard, ultimate humongousaur, uh, nanomech, uh, terraspin, ultimate spider monkey, ultimate spot fire, and then back to uh, Water Hazard. Now we can go Hero. So this thing is actually quite a surprise to me. Um, I didn't expect it to be uh, quite so cool. Um, I just picked it up because I had kind of an urge to buy an Omnitrix slash Ultimatrix since I haven't done it in a long time. And something to hide me over, tied me over to the Deluxe. Uh, this is a lot better uh, version than the Viewscope or I mean, the old you know, image turning ones. This is very cool. If you can't wait for the deluxe or you just want a cheaper alternative or something just to wear around for fun, this is really cool. Um, the way it pops up with the light, it's very accurate to the show. Kind of cool. You can see the guys here. The only complaint I really have about that mechanism is I wish you turned it from here like on the show, but whatever. It's still actually quite cool. I really like this a lot. Um, a lot more than I expected. So for the price, I can recommend it to hold you over for the deluxe version or even if you're getting both. A uh, solid piece of merchandise. Uh, it's a lot of fun to play with. Um, the fact that you this retracts all the way and pops up just like the show is just cool on its own for a cheaper version. So overall, a buy for a Ben 10 fan, if not just to hold you over to the deluxe version. So thank you all for staying tuned to the uh, Ben 10 Ultimate Alien Week. 
Um, that concludes it with this. Hopefully, fairly soon, there will be some more new releases. For sure, a uh, deluxe uh, Ultimatrix review will be coming out as soon as I get it. Um, any other toys that I find interesting will be here. So, this is in order to make up for the lack of Ben 10 reviews. And sorry, there hasn't been as many. You know, they don't release stuff as often as other stuff. So, this Alien Week will hopefully make up for it. So, as always, check out a written review for this at dawsomewriter.wordpress.com. Check out the podcast at uh, shugunshinobi.podbean.com. Um, and so, uh, subscribe to that through the RSS feed or the uh, iTunes. So, until next time, Dawson Writer signing out.